Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Chimo Moneki is coming after a great season in France and signed for the Spanish side Manresa for the next season. He was also invited for the Nigerian national team for the Olympics, but he didn't make it into the team. Chima is not the best shooter from distance. He can make some catch and shoot shots here and there, but not really a big threat behind the arc. He also isn't taking a lot of shots, maybe trying once or twice per game. The release doesn't look that bad though, and I think he could be used as a stretch forward more often, even though he's not that consistent as a shooter, but with more repetition he could become a decent scoring option. He's not a player that would attack a lot with drives in isolation. He usually has the advantage in quickness, but his handles are too poor. Attacks more often on the go and way better in catch and drive situations, but overall not a player that will score a lot of points with drives. Chima can post up some players sometimes and he's showing some solid feel down low. Has a balance and quick speed, but too many times he comes behind the backboard and tries to finish under some difficult angles. He is not afraid of contact and can draw some fouls with his physicality, but has some room to improve as an around the rim finisher. On the other hand, Chima is very dangerous when playing off ball, has great court awareness and feel for cuts and just feels it when it's wise to cut to the rim. With his athleticism, it is hard to stop him when he has the momentum and also able to catch the balls high above the rim and make some alley-oops. Very efficient as a cutter and I expect a lot of points from him from cuts in Manresa too. Chima is a really great runner but uses that advantage too rarely. If he would run the floor more often and look for more opportunities in transition, he could score a few more points per game. Not a player that would push the ball forward but knows his lane and runs directly towards the rim. Offensive rebounding is also a pretty big part of his offensive game. He has a relentless motor and the engine is always running. There are no lost balls and goes for offensive rebounds whenever there is an opportunity. Great feeling instincts even though he's not the tallest player on the court. Defensive potential from Chima is really high, has quick and active feet and can cover basically all position and has not many problems to switch and defend smaller guys on perimeter. Great reactions and reads and not giving up and letting easy points. The rotations are off sometimes and his closets could be a little better, but he can make an impact as a defender on perimeter. His energy and motor can be also spotted in his post-up defense. Not giving up, always fighting and not move that easily. Most players that try to attack him with post-ups are bigger than Chima, but they always have a hard time to get a good position or shot. He is really competitive and not afraid to get physical. Probably won't be able to defend the best of the best on post-ups, but definitely capable of defending most players in ACB too. As mentioned in the offensive rebounding, Chima has great feel and timing for rebounds. With his athleticism, motor and energy, he goes for every ball and can out rebound bigger players too. Even though he's just 6 feet 6 tall, he averaged 10 rebounds per 36 minutes in a physical French league, so this already tells us something about his rebounding qualities. Definitely can have similar rebounding numbers in Spain too. His block numbers aren't the highest, but he's a pretty good rim protector. Contests shots and makes an impact defensively, so the block numbers aren't telling the full story here. His anticipation for blocks is solid, especially when rotating from the weak side. To sum up, Chima Moneki brings relentless energy and hustle to the floor every night. Offensively, he's very good when playing off ball and if he becomes a little more active and effective in shots from distance, he could be even more dangerous. Can play outside and inside, but not that efficient as a creator with the ball in his hands. In defense, he can defend most positions and not be a liability in any situation. Great energy, plays physical and gives his best every night and most teams on any level would love to have a player like Chima in their team and I expect a very good season from him in Manresa.
and this is it for this time. If you liked the video, smash the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. If you miss any previous report, there's a playlist on the screen now and you can check them out. See you in the next video.